ordered us a roof rack from Vantech. It is made specifically for our year sprinter. And he is about to attempt to put it up on our roof this morning. Up this ladder rack here. So there's one there, 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 and there. We have four of them and they have a bar that goes from side to side across our van. You can use as many of these as you want. We just got two of them. But then we needed something to go from front to back to support our solar panels because our solar panels will be facing sideways like this, not like this. So we couldn't just put them directly on top of our ladder rack. So Dave bought two um, galvanized metal unistruts over there that we are painting white to match our ladder rack and they will go from front to back across here so that our solar panels can lay across there. And the whole entire thing will make only one single hole in our roof and that is for a solar panel wire to go through. There is no holes required for any of this rack. From silver to white. I don't know how well you can see that in this lighting. To match. The ladder rack is attached with nuts and bolts that came with the package from Vantech and they're super strong. I was honestly a little hesitant about how nuts and bolts could hold this up, but it is super strong. The super struts that we attached underneath have a small space underneath them, so they do not sit directly on the roof of our van. The metal is not touching metal, there is no rattling, and it is quiet when we drive. We use those L-shaped metal supports to attach the super struts to our ladder rack, again with nuts and bolts. Everything is super sturdy up there and it was ready for solar All panels. Right. Our solar panels are up and connected. They're obviously covered in cardboard for now to keep them protected. There's our solar panels. We have three of them, two in front of our fan, one behind our fan to make 300 watts of solar power. This wire will obviously not be here. It's the one that goes inside. We just have to cut a little wire hole there, which we'll be doing tomorrow. Good night. <laughs> so we cut the only hole that is required for our whole solar setup in our roof right there because these two wires here have to fit into the van to connect to the battery so the solar panels can do their job to charge our battery.